establish the identity secan theta minus secan theta times sin square theta is equal to cosine theta. So let's start with the left hand side. So this is what we have in the left side. Okay, so from left side, we got two terms, secant theta times sine square theta. Okay, this is still a, just one term and secant theta two terms. And out of these two terms, we can factor secant theta. So let's factor secant theta out. Nothing remained, that means one minus secant theta is out leave sine square theta that is secant theta let's leave there times 1 minus sine square theta okay there should be a formula because we know that sine square plus cosine square is 1 if we subtract sine square from both sides sine square theta then we get cosine square theta equals 1 minus sine square theta. That is 1 minus sine square theta is what we have here is same as cosine square theta. Okay, so this is cosine square theta. And we know that secant is reciprocal of cosine. We have cosine, so we need to change this into cosine. Uh, if we look at the right hand side, that's in terms of cosine as well. So secant is 1 over cosine times cosine square theta. That's just cosine times cosine theta, by the way. Cosine theta is square, you can write in this way. Or pretty much this is cosine times cosine. Now there are two copies of cosine on the top. So one copy and one copy cancel. Just cosine theta survives on the top which is the right side. That's how we get right hand side from left hand side. 